driven by an insatiable passion to unravel the mysteries and secrets of the cosmos. Humanity has embarked on a journey that defies the limits of time. Seeking answers to profound questions that challenge the fabric of reality, remarkably, the James Webb Space Telescope, with its keen eye, has indeed captured a glimpse of a cosmic formation that predates the birth of stars, an astronomical anomaly appearing to be older than the universe itself. You might wonder, how can a structure be older than our universe? Is the Big Bang Theory flawed? Join us as we explore how the James Webb Telescope recently detected a 13.8 billion-year-old entity and its far-reaching implications. Consider gazing into the vast cosmic realm where stars and galaxies perform a breathtaking dance of light and gravity, revealing the secrets of the cosmos and the future. This is the James Webb Space Telescope, a remarkable spacecraft that daily captures and transmits its breathtaking observations to Earth. Currently, it has uncovered a mystifying sight, a 13.8 billion-year-old celestial body that challenges our cosmic understanding. Through this extraordinary technological marvel, we encounter a profound cosmic mystery, a mystery intricately woven into the very fabric of space itself. This astonishing discovery has sparked a storm of discussions and questions within the scientific community as they strive to grasp the essence of this ancient entity. Both male and female scientists, as well as major observatories around the globe, are facing an incessant stream of inquiries about this complex phenomenon. The most prominent of these questions is, how did the James Webb Telescope detect a structure older than the universe itself? To answer this question, we must first zoom in on this ancient celestial entity. It is not a galaxy, nebula, or black hole. It is a star a truly ancient and unique star found over 200,000 light-years away near the constellation Libra. It is known as HD 140283, but it has an even more fitting name, the Methuselah Star, after the biblical figure who lived for 969 years. This superstar is not only ancient but also incredibly swift. It speeds through space at over 800,000 kilometers per hour, revealing its dramatic details from some 12 billion years ago when the precursor of our Milky Way galaxy absorbed a dwarf galaxy, which became its original home. However, what makes the Methuselah star truly fascinating is not its speed but its age. It is one of the oldest celestial objects we have ever found, and its age defies logic. According to initial estimates, the star was around 16 billion years old, but the most recent estimate is 14.46 billion years, with an uncertainty of 0.88 billion years. This figure presents a puzzle because the universe's age, as determined from observations of the cosmic microwave background, is about 13.8 billion years. How can a star be older than the universe itself? It seems impossible. This paradox has raised questions about the star's age, the age of the universe, or the accuracy of dating methods. Could the star be a remnant from a previous universe? Could the universe be older than we think? Could our dating methods be incorrect? Let's explore these possibilities. First, we need to consider that measuring the age of celestial objects is a daunting challenge. Stars like our sun retain their brightness, temperature, and size for billions of years, making age estimation difficult. Astronomers rely on changes in brightness and color over time and compare these measurements to mathematical models that predict how stars change with age, a process known as chronology. Another indicator of a star's age is its magnetic activity. Magnetic activity, such as flares and bursts of energy on a star's surface, decreases as the star ages. Astronomers have developed advanced techniques, including astroseismology, to study vibrations on a star's surface caused by waves traveling through its interior. These vibrations change with the Methuselah star's age, helping to estimate its age more accurately. For example, using this method, Astronomers have estimated the Sun's age to be around 4.58 billion years. Returning to the Methuselah star, astronomers have assigned such an ancient age to it by considering the population of stars it belongs to. Stars in the universe can be classified by the amount of heavy elements, or metals, they contain. Our Sun is a population one star with a vast amount of heavy elements. In contrast, the Methuselah star is a population two star with fewer heavy elements, particularly iron which means the star was born earlier than most heavy elements were created in the universe. 
These elements were created in the explosions of large stars known as supernovae. There is also a hypothetical class of stars called Population 3 stars that are believed to have virtually no heavy elements. These stars are thought to be the first ones to have formed in the primordial universe shortly after the Big Bang. They were extremely massive and hot, burning their fuel very rapidly, converting hydrogen and helium into heavier elements. When they died, they exploded as supernovae, scattering some of these elements into the surrounding space. Population 2 stars emerged from gas clouds that were slightly contaminated by these elements, while Population 1 stars originated from gas clouds that were further enriched by subsequent supernovae. The existence of the Methuselah star poses a complex question. How can it be older than the universe itself? The answer is not straightforward, as it involves a lot of uncertainty and assumptions. Based on measurements from the Hubble Space Telescope, there is a 70% chance that the Methuselah star's age ranges from 13.6 to 14.6 billion years and a 15% chance that it is even lower. Considering all of the factors, there is at least a 20% chance that the star's true age is younger than the universe's age. This is like rolling a die and getting a 6, which is not very unlikely, but this also assumes that there are no other sources of error or bias in the age estimation. Although it is clear that the Methuselah star is incredibly ancient, in fact, it is the oldest star in the universe with a reasonably accurate age determination. Instead of wondering if it could be more than 2 billion years older than its environment, we can approach the problem from a different perspective. Could it be that the universe is not as young as scientists initially thought? In fact, it is hard to comprehend the vastness of 13.8 billion years. If we compress the entire history of the universe into a cosmic calendar with the Big Bang as the most spectacular New Year's fireworks show, Earth would not appear until late December. Recorded human history would span the last 10 seconds of December 31st. Scientists calculated the age of the universe by observing the light from stars that were born only a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. As the universe expands, it stretches this ancient light, making it redder, a phenomenon known as redshift. By measuring both the distance and the redshift of these stars, scientists can infer the age of the universe. Recent findings from scientists at the University of Ottawa suggest that the universe might be much older than previously thought. They suggested that it could be around 26.7 billion years old. Gupta, a physics professor at the University of Ottawa, mentions an old idea of Swiss astronomer Fritz Zwicky dating back to 1929. This idea claims that photons lose energy as they travel through vast distances in time. This contradicts the observable redshift data, but Gupta argues that by accepting this idea together with the expanding universe, we can explain redshift as a combined phenomenon that is not only due to expansion. Expanding the universe's age could shed light on some long-standing cosmological mysteries. This mystery stems from data collected by the European Space Agency's Gaia satellite, which provides accurate data on the speeds and positions of nearly 2 billion stars in the Milky Way. These precise measurements have led astronomers to reconsider their views on stellar behavior throughout the galaxy. Several research groups have shown that stars orbiting the Milky Way's outer disk, about 88,000 light-years from the galactic center, travel at an average speed of 167 kilometers per second. This is considerably slower than stars in similar outer regions of other spiral galaxies, which travel at an average speed of about 240 kilometers per second. Astronomers estimated that stars far from the galactic center would have velocities more like the speeds of those in other galaxies. These discoveries have led to changes in the scientific community's understanding of how galaxies form and evolve. The Milky Way's behavior and the presence of dark matter pose questions about the nature of our universe's structural and evolutionary processes. Scientists have been grappling with these questions, striving to understand the fundamental principles that govern the cosmos. Recent advances, such as those enabled by the James Webb Space Telescope and Gaia Satellite, have provided unprecedented insights into these cosmic mysteries. They have allowed astronomers to explore distant corners of the universe and observe phenomena that challenge our current understanding of space and time. As humanity continues its exploration of the cosmos, driven by curiosity and technological advancement, we can expect even more astonishing discoveries that will reshape our understanding of the universe and our place within it. The journey to unravel these mysteries is ongoing, promising new revelations and deeper insights into the vast and intricate cosmos that surrounds us.
The exploration of the cosmos has been a journey marked by humanity's insatiable curiosity and relentless pursuit of knowledge. It is a quest that spans centuries, driven by technological advances and a deep desire to unravel the mysteries of the universe. At the forefront of this exploration are powerful tools like the James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, and the Gaia Satellite, which have revolutionized our understanding of celestial bodies and cosmic phenomena. One of the most intriguing discoveries facilitated by these instruments is the Methuselah Star, officially known as HD 140283. This star, nicknamed Methuselah after the biblical figure known for his extreme longevity, has sparked significant debate and fascination within the scientific community. Initially estimated to be around 16 billion years old, which would precede the current age of. The universe is calculated from observations of the cosmic microwave background radiation, CMBR. Methuselah's age presents a perplexing paradox. The age of the universe is estimated to be approximately 13.8 billion years based on the CMBR data. This raises fundamental questions about the accuracy of our dating methods, the nature of cosmic evolution, and the possibility of alternative explanations, such as a remnant from a previous universe or variations in the fundamental constants of physics over time. To understand the age and nature of celestial objects like Methuselah, astronomers employ sophisticated techniques such as astroseismology, which studies the oscillations of stars to infer their internal structure and age. This method, along with measurements of a star's chemical composition and orbital dynamics, provides crucial insights into their formation and evolution. Stars are classified into different populations based on their content of heavy elements like iron. Population 1 stars, such as our Sun, are relatively young and rich in heavy elements, indicating they formed from enriched interstellar gas. In contrast, population 2 stars, like Methuselah, are older and contain fewer heavy elements suggesting they formed from pristine gas that had not been enriched by previous generations of stars. The discovery of Methuselah challenges our understanding of stellar evolution and the early universe's conditions. It suggests that stars may have formed earlier than previously thought, possibly in a universe that underwent rapid changes in its early stages. This concept aligns with theories proposing that the universe may have experienced phases of accelerated expansion or variations in the fundamental constants that could affect the passage of time and the age of celestial objects. Advancements in observational astronomy, particularly through instruments like JWST and the Gaia satellite, continue to push the boundaries of our knowledge. These tools enable astronomers to peer deeper into space and observe phenomena with unprecedented clarity and detail. For instance, Gaia's precise measurements of star positions and velocities have provided new insights into the structure and dynamics of our Milky Way galaxy, revealing unexpected patterns in stellar motions and the distribution of dark matter. Dark matter remains one of the most enigmatic substances in the universe, accounting for a significant portion of its mass yet eluding direct detection. Its presence is inferred from gravitational effects on visible matter and the motions of galaxies and galaxy clusters. Understanding dark matter is essential for comprehending the large-scale structure of the universe and the shape of galaxies, including our own Milky Way. Recent observations from Gaia have shown that stars in the outer regions of the Milky Way move at slower speeds than expected compared to stars in similar locations in other spiral galaxies. This discrepancy suggests that our galaxy may have a different distribution of dark matter, or that our understanding of dark matter's properties needs refinement. These findings challenge existing models of galaxy formation and evolution, prompting astronomers to reconsider their theories about the interplay between dark matter and ordinary matter in shaping cosmic structures. The study of galaxy formation and evolution is a complex and multifaceted field that combines observations across different wavelengths of light, theoretical modeling, and simulations. It seeks to unravel how galaxies like the Milky Way emerge from the primordial universe and evolve over billions of years through processes such as star formation, mergers, and interactions with their environments. Galaxies exhibit a diverse range of shapes, sizes, and compositions, reflecting their unique histories and interactions. Spiral galaxies, like the Milky Way, are characterized by their flattened disk-like structures with spiral arms containing young stars, gas, and dust. Elliptical galaxies, on the other hand, are more spheroidal in shape and often lack the organized structure of spiral arms, 
containing older stars and less interstellar material. The Hubble sequence, or tuning fork diagram, classifies galaxies based on their visual appearance, ranging from ellipticals, E, to spirals, S, and irregulars, I. This classification system provides a framework for understanding the diversity of galaxies and their evolutionary paths. It highlights the role of gravitational interactions, gas accretion, and internal processes in shaping galaxy morphology and dynamics. The formation of galaxies is thought to be driven by the hierarchical growth of dark matter halos, which provide the gravitational scaffolding for the accumulation of gas and stars. Small primordial fluctuations in the density of dark matter and ordinary matter evolved over time into structures ranging from dwarf galaxies to massive galaxy clusters. Simulations of galaxy formation utilize supercomputers to model the complex interactions between dark matter, gas, and stars over cosmic timescales. These simulations enable astronomers to test theoretical predictions against observational data and refine our understanding of the physical processes that govern galaxy evolution. They have provided insights into the formation of galactic bulges, the growth of supermassive black holes at galaxy centers, and the role of feedback mechanisms in regulating star formation. Supermassive black holes are ubiquitous in the centers of galaxies, including our Milky Way, where a black hole with a mass of approximately 4 million times that of the Sun resides. These black holes are thought to form through the accretion of gas and mergers with other black holes during galaxy interactions. They play a crucial role in shaping galaxy evolution by releasing energy through powerful jets and outflows that can influence the surrounding gas and star formation.